And what a gutsy performance from the Filipina. Really under the cosh. Fighting open mouth. Little choice in that because her nostrils will be full of her own blood. Game enough to take the center of the ring and come forward. Headlock takedown. Didn't quite work out the way Yang wanted it to. Perhaps tiring a little herself. Look at Gina. Plenty of Filipinos at ringside here supporting their girl. They'll be concerned. But they won't be able to falter for her gameness. And the crowd responds. And so they should. What a performance from these two. A good right hand from Gina as Yang came in. And again. And the left hand. But Young is oncoming, just brushes the hair from her mouth. Could do with tying that up slightly better, perhaps. Young is definitely slowed down a bit. You can see her breathing is getting a little bit heavier. And Gina actually seems to be picking up her pace. And she connected with a short right to the chin, which would hurt. But just look at Gina. She's in so much pain. She's struggling with fatigue, but she won't stop. Inches backwards. Oh, the right came in, it was low. Knees to the body. She's faking that side kick and then le leading with that jab. Both girls connected there, flailing punches from Gina. A swinging right hand that landed, that was short. Oh, both girls tired, can you blame them? I bet it won't be long before John Shah encourages them, yes, there you are, to get back to it. You can definitely see fatigue across the face of both ladies. There was a clash of heads there that did neither girl any good. Oh, right hand, another right hand from Gina. She will not give up. And this is the part of the fight where Hart just absolutely has to take over. They're exhausted, hands are dropping, covered in blood. And the crowd is encouraging, here we go. Egged on by the crowd here to fight in these last 10 seconds, but I think you can forgive them. The opportunity to take a rest. I don't think we're gonna see any more action in that second round. Just waiting for the bell. I'm okay with that, how about you? Oh. That tells a story. Young, waiting for a stool to come in. Hands on knees, takes her own gun shield out. Catches all the breath she can. There's that takedown. She pins in the arm and then just administers a little bit of ground and pound. A closer round this time, Mitch. But did Gina do enough to get herself back into the fight? I don't think so. I still got to give that round to Young. She controlled the pace of the fight. She slowed considerably at the end, but still managed to deliver a lot more damage. And just enjoy the final five minutes. Two brave, highly skilled, and exciting girls in front of us. We've had 10 minutes of action, and there's five more to come. Here we go, round three. Gina from the Philippines, wearing all black. Young from China, in the yellow and green. And they're at it again, Mitch, in the center of the ring. Both hands coming in. Heavy exchanges. Good left hand from Gina. She does do the smarter Ooh. work with her fists. Lands a kick to the body. Young just swinging for the fences on each pop. And Gina was pulled into a position where her back was to her opponent and she caught a right hand from Young just on the side of her face. Again, they take the opportunity for a bit of a breather in the center of the ring and no sooner do they do that than John Shah urges them to get back into it. And back they go and there could be a cut that's opened up in the center, just right between the eyes there. Is that a cut or is that, it is a cut. It's come from a lump. I wondered for a moment if it was just some of Gina's blood, but that is a cut that's opened up. 
Don't leave it to the judges, girls. Don't leave it to the judges, girls, John Shah says, urging them to finish this contest. I don't think anyone else here at ringside wants to see the contest finished. Quite rightly, John Shah asked for the audience's participation in this. They deserve all the backing they can get. Both women with visible injuries to their face, and they're both giving it everything as we approach the midway point of this final round. Will anyone ever forget this contest? Anyone who's seeing it in the flesh here at Resource World Sentosa, Marshall Combat 6. You're doing great, ladies. Let's work. Let's go. Still bouncing on her feet, Gina from the Philippines. You can see the exhaustion across both of these women's faces. They're very hesitant to do anything. Oh, there's the big right hand. As Gina came in, she got clubbed by a swinging left. Nice high guards from both girls. Great Ooh. left hand from Gina. Nice counter hook. What's your fingers? What's your fingers? It, it stunned the Chinese girl, but she's on her feet and wasn't rocked. I think it's fair to say that, but it was a clean, crisp left Ooh. hook and a good kick to the same part of the face. With the counter right hand. Can she do enough damage with those punishing punches and kicks, Gina? to turn this one around. She'll need to free herself up and get some distance between her and her opponent. Because she hasn't been able to take it to the ground successfully today. And that's what we were expecting of her. We figured that Young's weakness would be on the mat and she's kept it standing up. She's done a great job, the girl from China. And the restart in the center of the ring. For both ladies. Good right hand and countered with another right hand. Exchanging big blows, these girls. Oh, and again. Good left from Gina. She receives Ooh. one as well. These two giving and getting everything they can muster. Throwing herself into that. Almost ended up on the canvas. Oh, a good kick to the midriff from Young. Surely she's done enough to win this contest, but it's been an absolute delight for us all. What admiration you simply have to have for the two of them. Still working hard, Gina, even with her back press to the cage. Pummeling her opponent with rights to the side of the body. Refusing to stop working. She's got to try to spin off that cage, otherwise she will get a restart in the center of the ring. Cage, rather. She's got to try to spin off, but Yang just has hey, her stop. pressed so tightly up, and there's the restart in the you center of the it, cage. You called it, Mitch. John Shaw brings them to the center of the ring for what could be one of the final exchanges of this contest. Enjoy it while you can, folks. It's not often you see anything like this. Oh, the clash of flesh. The final 10 seconds, the crowd on their feet at ringside, cheering them on. Right hands come in from the girl from China, Gina on her last legs. What a contest. Surely it has to be Young from China who wins it, extending a record to 3-0. and Well, let's leave that to the judges. Mitch, what a contest. Very impressive bout by two incredible athletes. And the crowd erupts, the standing ovation. This Great is display. what martial combat is all about. It's not just the fellas. It's not just the fellas. Judge Brett Gleason scored the round 30 to 26. Judge Joey Lipton scored the round 29 to 28, and Judge Judge Sanchez scored the round 30 to 27. And by way of unanimous decision, the winner in the red corner, Yang Fury
a thrilling contest. Is there anybody out there who could possibly disagree? Could you just tell us how you feel? Good. Says it feels good. Feels good for us as well. Can I allow you to pay tribute to your opponent? Because your opponent was very, very game today. She wants to thank everybody, thank her opponent. I think after a performance like that, I must be correct in saying we'd all like to see you back. Will you come back and fight at Marshall Combat again? Uh, she wants to come back. She thinks Singapore is beautiful. We think you're beautiful too. Many, many congratulations. Come on, everyone.